Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Today we finally get on to the trial after kind of talking ourselves into circles in the last one. And but finally also getting that last bit of information that does prove that Sunray is guilty. Um, also, I do cut out a few moments here in this episode where we get a little more philosophical just like kind of outside of the game mechanics and stuff like we kind of all the whole chat kind of went on this like whole like philosophical tirade so there are some moments that just kind of cut away a little bit but most it's just me like walking around and I just cut out those moments where we're getting really super philosophical so it doesn't like uh get too tied down in that so anyway I hope you all enjoyed the episode it was really interesting this was I I kind of I really like these kind of trial things so um yeah hope you guys enjoy and I will see you in a moment uh, I want to begin Sunray's trial. Consult the Force? Okay, okay, uh, hang on, not yet. Are you dead, Flipper Ann? Let's get this trial over with. Okay, hang on, let me save. Like, like Rain just said, I will save. Whoop, save. Sometimes being utilitarian is good, but not always. Right, right, exactly. Yeah, like for the greater good, is it actually for the greater good? Or is it, like, I don't know. Like, do you do you lose that sense of, like, humanity or whatever, the connection to, like, ev to individual people if you try to play the big picture game? You know what I mean? Like, there's pros and cons to both sides. Uh, start the trial. Yes, let's begin the trial. It would be more morally complicated if the two sides were two nations, but one side's literally the same. Yeah. But at the same time, is that... That's not impartial. That's not being impartial. You know what I mean? Yeah, okay. We know the judges. Yes, judges, judges. Okay. No comments at this time. An impartial observer from the Sith Empire? It is an For honor Otto to see City? justice. Really? And I will see Sunri is executed for the crime he has committed. I kind of want to make Sunri innocent now. Yeah, he's not being impartial. The, the Sith can't be impartial in this. But one of their people died. The man I saw leaving, Sunri, probably left after I heard the blaster shot. The guilt of the accused is apparent even this early oh in the trial. Oh my gosh, shut up! Keep this in mind at the top of the list of permanent facts. I have my lightsaber in my hand. I'm ready to, I'm ready to break it down. I'm an unlock only to defend it. Okay. So I can go through with this trial and then state that he's guilty at the end. Fearith. You are Fearith Me, the well known Pazak player. I wonder if we can trust the word of a, a gambler oh as reliable gosh, testimony. Uh, Objection! Objection! <laughs> I know, right? What? That whole discussion in one minute back to the Sith sounding British well, and I'm ready to kick him out the, the door. night of the murder? Well, I came out into the hallway after hearing the blaster shot and saw Sunri over there limping down the hall out of the building. <laughs> A very obvious point, Your Honours. The accused was seen leaving the scene of the crime Makes after the blaster makeup, that man. killed Elasa was fired. Work for your skin tone. Or cross-examining, oh boy. 
your confidence at the test. Oh my gosh, how long does it take to say that? Um... Uh, also is a dark Jedi, isn't she? Yes, from what I could tell, she carried a lightsaber under that cloak of hers. Objection! That doesn't prove she was a Jedi. <laughs> By getting that hint earlier that I needed to go into the uh, Republic files, now that's like very much complicated this. Otherwise, I would have come in here and been like, Sunry's innocent, but at the same time, I knew something was off about the data. Something was off. Because Sunri kept saying that he had, like, left immediately, whereas everybody else was like, he stayed. Uh, did you actually see the murder happen? You mean, actually see him kill her with my own eyes? Well, no, but I don't think there could have been anyone else there. <laughs> I'm gonna like go through this whole thing and point out that he's like innocent and then like at the end I'm gonna be like he's guilty uh... oh so Sunry is not even in here or no he is I don't know I have no additional questions because I think I'm gonna I, I don't know let's see I think it may have been I mean You'd have to be pretty stupid to leave something that important lying around, wouldn't you? <laughs> this argument has merit. I have no. I mean, a cripple could hurt. Like, like you don't. You don't. He is only crippled on his leg. It's not like he couldn't shoot a gun. You know. I have no additional questions. <laughs> If you were truly loyal to the Republic, you might consider killing him so the Republic's involvement goes to the grave. Ooh. Good point. No messy trial either. Hey. Uh, yeah? Okay. Okay. Okay, Rodian Glooper. Glooper the Rodian, you were staying in the hotel the night of the murder and saw Sunri leaving Alasa's room, didn't you? This is clear then, that Sunri left the room with the Sith Elasa already dead behind him. Did you plant the metal on her? Glupor, Glupor. Don't do it, Glupor. Lies! Slander! I object! Even earlier, he after he said, Don't do it! Glue for certain. Sunri's lawful wife. Your husband was a hero in the last war between the Sith Empire and the Republic. He was crippled in that war, 
Do you not believe he'd blame the Sith for his injury? Yes. I guess he would. And there you have <laughs> motive. Sunri seeks revenge on the Sith for what they did to him and killed Elasa. That was a big jump. Uh, was it true your husband was having an affair with Elasa? Yes. Yes, it was harlot. true. He was having an affair with that Sith harlot. It seems painfully obvious that he killed her to keep her quiet about the affair. Yeah, he's not a very good prosecutor. He'd been seeing her for some time, I think. But he said he was going to yeah. change. He'd gone there that night to end it. We talked the night before and he'd promised. But now things have become so very complicated. It's the worst. <laughs> questions yes ah, okay i wish to call forth wow. sorry himself okay. your honors this is getting very dramatic i feel like the tension's ramping up are you a war hero mr sunry you fought in wars against the sith empire correct yes that's right and i don't regret it either the republic needs its heroes indeed would you say that you dislike the Sith? Even hate them? Of course ah! I hate them! Trying to take over the galaxy every chance they get? Killing millions of innocents? Pure politics. Pure politics. Were you in Alasa's room on the night of the murder? Well, yes, I, I was. I had been having well, an affair okay. with Alasa and my wife, yes. But I realized how wrong I'd been and I was going there to end it. You were having an affair with a uh -huh. Sith. You wanted to end it quickly and quietly, so you killed her from behind and tried to flee. No, I... I think we can see the answer clear enough, Mr. Sunry. You guys got a terrible... Someone needs some law and order gaveling? I know, right? We need some gavels. Elasa was a Sith spy, wasn't she? Of course she was. Why would a young, beautiful Sith woman get with an old cripple like me? You didn't you didn't you didn't think you got that before. She had gotten hold of your medal? I don't know. The medal had gone missing some time ago. I never found out what happened to it. It's possible the Sith had stolen it and had it planted on the body. Supposition, Your Honors? <laughs> True, but it has merit. Okay. There's a cell cat! No crazy. Uh, you were going to end the affair with the Sith object. Yes, I think they would. They wouldn't want to lose one of their sources, even though I didn't give them Of course anything. not. They... they might have killed her for her failure. Or they might have thought she'd turn against them or something like that. The Sith Empire is not the barbaric institution you portray it to be. I only know their name, Neprezu, because they have their names floating over their heads. <laughs> No additional questions. Yes. Oh, the evidence. Okay, the evidence is weighted against Sunny. I thought they were going to say the same things over and over again. So, two of them said they don't have enough information yet. One says they probably want to convict Sunny. I can't remember what the other one said. Obviously guilty. Okay, 
opposing facts. <clears throat> I think the facts in this case are very straightforward. Sunri was having an affair with Elasa. He sought to end it, and the simplest, quickest method given his hatred of the He wouldn't have had an affair if he hated them that much. Kill her. Witnesses saw Sunri fleeing the like, scene, and material evidence places him there at the time of the murder as well. I am confident that any informed observation of the facts will lead the judges, your honors, to this very conclusion. They look like turtles and they sound gross. <laughs> are complete uh, I don't know I was thinking I'd have a chance to like actually do it myself but I, apparently I don't Wow you guys kill for wow I thought he was going to go to prison. Your honors, I demand the death oh, penalty. Calm down. My defense seems to be not saying anything, kind of, yeah, I think. I mean, I don't know. I wanted him to be prosecuted. I don't believe this. I mean, Sunri should be remembered as a hero, not as a murderer. What? Not right. Karth, are you serious? All right, hang on. I kind of Sunry. want to go back and do the, like, actual thing where I'm like, hey, here he is. He actually, he did actually commit the murder. Uh... Um... Go back. Oop, that's caps lock. Um, go back. Trial. Yeah, they condemn him now just to annoy Karth. Well, like, I don't, it doesn't make sense to me. Like, I don't know why Karth would be like, uh, the all the evidence. Like, all the evidence. Obviously, well, not, okay. I feel like the evidence actually points to him to to Sunri being innocent. So it's interesting that the judges all thought that he was not innocent. Because to me, the evidence looked like it was he was innocent. So I uh, right, a car's a good person as long as it's the right kind of good. Well, and that's the thing is, it's like. Just because the guy was a war hero doesn't mean that he didn't do terrible things, like, later, you know? And besides, war heroes are often war criminals. Like, after the war is over, war heroes are often prosecuted as war criminals. So, I think I want to do this correctly, and I want to get him prosecuted, but I want to do it because I, I want them to know for certain that he did it. Like, you know? Uh-huh. Let's do the trap. Like, I want to do it properly. I don't think it'll change much, but it feels a little weird to, like, have it being done that way. Uh, Sunri is guilty of the murder. I have this recording as proof. Karth's heavily biased here. He definitely is. It's like... We can't cover up a murder, Karth. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, we could, but, like, that's not the air quotes right thing to do. The right thing to do is to prosecute him. With the evidence given. It was interesting to do the cross-examination, though. I did want to, I wanted to do that. 
Sunry should be remembered as a hero, not as a murderer. Cards is whiny right. and wrong, he is. Wow, that was fast. Oh, Sunry, no. Uh, Bauer had planned that the footage had been faked by the Sith, but eventually they cut all that guy. Uh, cut all that. Cut all that out. Yeah, rip that guy. Wow. Uh, but okay, why in this instance is the Cellcath like? Uh, yeah, kill him. Whereas in the other instance, where they still decided that he was guilty, they're like, let's not kill him. Let's give him a life term sentence type thing. Like, what? Why is it different? Irrefutable proof? You, oh, you think? Okay, yes, right. I mean, that, that's why I wanted to redo it, was because it was irrefutable proof that he was guilty, and so that people wouldn't be, like, all weird about it. But, like, now I'm, now I'm like, oh, man, I kind of just want him to go to get, like, life in prison. But I don't know. I don't know if I should just stick with this one or if I should go back. Dead. Oh, hi. Hi. Is this, is this, is this Reaper here? Nuclear, the, Nuclear the Reaper? <laughs> what a cheery entrance. I know, right? Ah! I don't know. Do you guys think I should, I should, uh, go back on my word? And redo it, or should I just keep it? Cause like I think he deserves to be punished, but maybe not put to death for it. Even though it was a very cowardly thing he did. Like he's also an old man and doesn't have a ton of time to live. Uh, keep the death and appraise you. You're so bloodthirsty. Death. Oh my gosh, you're so bloodthirsty. Do what I want. Well, I don't know. It's not really fair to manipulate the outcome of a trial by being able to save scum. And, like, deciding which outcome I like better. Either he's in prison for the rest of his life, or he gets executed. Ah! Now I feel bad. But, because, like, I don't know. Like, and then you, you gotta ask the question, like, does everything in his life, does everything that he's done up until this point all of a sudden get negated because he murdered somebody? Like, does, does all, the, all the good things he's done, like being a war hero, does that get overshadowed by the one murder, like, the one cowardly murder he did? Or if it's like actually on a set of scales, has he done more good than bad? And does that matter in the end? Or is he only going to be punished for this one action he did that was a terrible thing? You know what I mean? You say help him break out, Dark Jedi must die. The victim was a naughty, sexy Seth harlot. He did also cheat on his wife, so I think he's kind of a garbo person. But I don't know if he needs deserves necessarily to be put to death. Besides, death's always an easy answer, right? It's an easy out. Like, people who do things they shouldn't, I feel like should suffer and live, you know? But, uh, you know, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back. I just want him, I just want him to spend his life in prison thinking about his actions. How do you pick light side or dark side? It's through your actions throughout the game, Blueberry. You, uh, you pick, like, certain, like, dialogue options and stuff like that. If you try to be an a-hole, you'll get dark side points. If you're a nice person, you'll get light side points. And it's just kind of throughout the game. Garbo person equals no more trials. Just keep the outcome. Uh... Right? Yeah. I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna go back. I, I think he deserves to be punished, but maybe not put to death. So we'll go back. We, we, we've got, I've reloaded now, and we're back on the one what? where he's put in jail for the rest of his life, but he's not killed. Because I can do that because it's a video game. Uh, sure. Feet provides a plus three bonus. Blah, 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 blah. I think I'm actually gonna level up. Feet quadruples the critical threat range of the ranged attack. His attack hits. 
His feet lowers defense by minus five. Um, suffers minus one to defense while using his feet and for three seconds afterwards. He also suffers a minus one penalty to all attacks that round. Does that stack? Like, if I use that ability over and over, does it stack? That's my opinion. And I want to date Karth, but, like, you know, I'm still like, Karth, shut up. <laughs> uh, it's a plus 10 damage to this blaster, minus 3 penalty to hit. I think I'll do, I'm going to upgrade this one. Add feet. Okay. Accept. Done. We did I'm it. I'm here. Well, for some reason, by the same guy who voices what? The same person who does Scooby Doo and Fred. I'm a goody two shoes. Says heck too much. I do, don't I? His, his wife, Laura, is voiced by Doc. She's voiced by Doctor Chocolates. What? I should go to the submarine now, which is in the restricted area over here. Right? Nope. Oh, dang, where am I going? I can't ever find my way out of here. Holding so. I wonder if I should. Can I talk to Jolie about this? Yo. Got something on you. What do you think of Sunray's verdict? You defended him well enough. I wish we had time to look into matters more fully, but wishing is only useful for the young and idealistic. What's done is done. The Republic will likely appeal what? the matter eventually, and he'll be free. I just... Oh, I, I just would like to know if that's best. Sunry was a good man once. And so, a what? good friend. I'll Did I not you. show yeah. him? I don't want to talk about this anymore. My Did I not face. show him the footage I got that proves that he's guilty? Oh my gosh. I don't know. It's whatever. It's whatever, man. It's whatever at this point. Blah, blah, blah. Sometimes, sometimes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Am I gonna finish Manon this stream? Probably not. Uh, if they're friendly, they killed her not because he betrayed her, but because she was a dark Jedi and too dangerous to be left alive, like Mace Windu wanted to kill Palpatine. Um, hmm. I mean, the thing is, is like, I don't know. And maybe, maybe I'm taking, again, maybe I'm taking a moral high ground on this, where it's like, you know, I'm like, you can't just kill a person in cold blood, but you can. Like, you, she was a bad person. Like, I don't know. Like, she probably was a bad person. You don't become a Sith Jedi, like a dark Jedi, because you're a nice person, you know? So it's like, mm, I don't know. It's a really complicated situation. And I am I think I just half, you know, I think I just half-assed it, basically, by putting him into life in prison. And now, now I'm second-guessing everything! Now I want to. Now I want to be like, because partly because of what Joe Lee said, where he's like, I just wish we knew definitively. But it's like, oh, we do know definitively that he's guilty, and ah, uh, that's my problem. Is that ah? Uh, now I'm. Now I want to second guess myself. Oh, I get it. Let's play <laughs> with the old man's head. Is it? He's half seen now. He You'll forget I said anything. What was this about anyway? Oh, you poor old man. Old man. I love I love Jolie. He's so funny. Now I'm see now all this all this this all this has got me all I don't know. Like that's why I went with the, the original that's why I went with it originally was because I wanted the definitive proof that he was guilty. If I change my mind again, I can't change it anymore. I can't. <laughs> we would never say override a computer to cause an electrical overload killing everyone in a room and anything to us but we're on our way yeah that's the thing is like we've done i mean you know technically that they're gonna take action on you in the future but do you have the right to like go in there and just well not even go in there but just kill them from a distance like i don't know it's all so very complicated it depends on the intent of sunry's motivation for the act which we can't truly know uh yeah I mean, he said that the, the motivation was because he was mad that he was being used as a spy. This really isn't, this real, I, I mean, it's a complicated situation, but it's in a video game and I really shouldn't be worrying about it this much, but I am. Like, 
Okay. Okay. For Jolie's sake, so that we have a definitive outcome, I'm changing my mind one last time, and I'm not doing it again. I'm actually gonna delete the save. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna delete the save after I do this. Uh, 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 uh. I had this recording. Yep. I don't believe it. Okay, fine. All right, I did it. I decided. I've decided. I did, I've decided, and now I'm gonna delete the other one. I'm deleting this one. Delete. I've made my decision. Save it again. Uh, made decision. I can't spell, it's fine. Bleah! Ida! Hello! How's it going? It is indeed. It's Coder. We are playing the Coder game. Okay. What did I... So we finished that. Alright. So we found him definitively guilty, and now I need to talk to Jolie. Got something on your... Reading of Sunri's verdict. You did what was necessary. Sunri was guilty. As sad as that fact makes me. Justice had to be done. Doesn't matter that his victim was a Sith or that he was once a hero. I only so here we have the black and white justice, it. right? That's he the did thing the wrong thing and got punished. They don't come true. And now Sunray's dead, which is a shame. He was a good man, you know, once. Well, I don't want to talk about this anymore. My jaw aches. Yeah, I mean, it's a rough situation. It really is. Like, I don't know, does one action... But then again, like, one action can indicate... And a change that's come upon a person, you know, that, like they're at that they've changed as a person. So yeah, it makes things complicated. But anyway, it's okay. I went on my tirade, and now everybody's left. <laughs> and there we have it. After all that, we finally <laughs> went through several changes. I know some people don't really like it when you backtrack on choices, but it's a video game. And uh, I can save scum. That's a thing I can do. So I try not to do it too terribly often. But in this one, I got really torn. So I know there are some purists who want you to just stick with the first decision. And I respect that. But that's not how I play often. So anyway, uh, sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. In this situation, I don't. But yeah, at this point, I think we're about to hopefully after this, we're going to hop into the submarine and go down to one of my most favorite favorite parts that I had in a home game. So I hope you all enjoyed it and I hope to see you in the next one.